Hello, can you mind telling everyone your name? My name is Dion Simmons. And uh, what did you first come to the office for? I had major back pain. I felt it mostly in the back of my leg, but there was actually a problem happening in my back and the pain was so severe that I didn't really feel it as much in my back as I did all the way down the back of my leg. And well, how intense, like just to explain to people on a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being the worst, how bad was the pain? There were times when the pain was actually at a 10. I um, actually could not sit still in a chair for longer than an hour or two at a time. It felt better if I stood up and walked around, even though my body physically wanted to sit down. I couldn't sleep very well at night. I had to lay on a flat surface like the floor. I had to take medication. Um, the pain was at several times at a 10. And uh, what, before you came to the office, who, what other providers were you seeing and what attempts did they take to try to fix the problem? I went to my regular physician. He referred me to an orthopedic specialist. I had an MRI done. Then that showed that I had a herniated disc. The orthopedic specialist wanted to perform surgery. I was not open to having surgery. I went back to my, physical, my regular um, physician and he suggested physical therapy. And I was doing that when my mom actually suggested, why don't you go back to Dr. Andy and see what he can do. And how, well, how long did you attempt the physical therapy before coming in? Probably about a month. This pain started in July, and I think I started the physical therapy sometime in August. So that was about a month before I actually started seeing Dr. Andy. And so the results in that month were substandard or non-satisfactory, and that's what brought you in here? Yes, I was still having pain. I'm still have, I was still having flare-ups. Uh, very, very little relief. Um, the only time I really got relief was by taking pain medication, which I don't like to do either. And I was taking some prescription pain medication. That's the only time I got some relief. And then, so what, what did we find with you with, you know, brain-based therapy? What were the things that we did, and what results have you seen? Okay, I have to tell you, um, when Dr. Andy first started talking about brain-based therapy, I, I thought, okay. Um, didn't really <laughs> prescribe to it, but I was open. And his first thought was, let's do something where we're bringing more oxygen to the brain, which is going to fire off a lot of neurons to really help strengthen the core. Um, we also did exercise on the upper body ergometer, right. which is exercising your arms. And that also brings oxygen there. We did oxygen therapy. I actually had a cannula and was connected to an oxygen uh, machine while I laid on the decompression table. So those were things that I did every time I came as well as the regular adjustment, chiropractic adjustments. The first few times I started feeling a little bit of relief. Then I started having a couple of flare-ups and every time I came he would, he would monitor and mark down uh, what my pain level was. I did a full assessment when I first came. I did a full assessment midway through and a full final assessment on my last day of treatment. And you could see a marked improvement throughout that time frame. And what you, your pain used to be a 10. What, what is your pain level now? Oh my gosh, it's less than a 1. Great. And uh, to anyone else who's out there with a disc herniation such as yourself that's not having success with physical therapy, they're contemplating going under the knife and getting surgery. Don't that's do it. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Have your easy. mind open to try other alternative therapies. Seriously, I've gone to Dr. Andy before years ago for back problems and he's and that's been very no, excuse me, not back problems. I was in a car accident and went to Dr. Andy for that several years ago and that was very successful treatment and hadn't really even considered it until my mother reminded me. And when I came, again, I was very open to, to what he suggested do the exercises. He was the first one to actually give me exercises to do at home. I, w I went to physical therapy for a month and they never, they never gave me exercises to try at home. So stick with it, go through the entire process, be open to what he tells you and you will find some relief. I've, I can't describe to you the difference that, that this has made from four or five months ago to today. I feel like 100% better. Thank you so much for sharing. Thank you.